right, I'm here with our winner, Julian Marquez. Julian, holy moly, what a way to finish off the night. Just give us your thoughts. What's going through your head right now? Man, uh, really don't know. I was well, tired. Um, weight cut yesterday was pretty rough. Obviously, you can tell by my voice. But, uh, I mean, I just knew that he's just going to keep going and going. That if I would have gave it a second and waited to weather the storm, he'd leave an opening, which he did. Let's take a look at that finish over here on the monitor. You were able to deliver some beautiful elbows, had him up against the fence, had him really, really hurt, and then landed this humongous, perfectly timed head kick. What do you see? I mean, talk us through this. What are you thinking right now? Well, I saw that opening earlier when I was on the side. I tried to go for a dart stroke, and I saw him stand up, and I saw him look away from me. Then he looked back. So then when I got in against the cage, I knew there's only one way for him to go was towards that right leg. So what I did is the moment when he came up with his hands down, I just threw the leg and it landed perfect. You weathered the storm early in that first round. Were you hurt at all in that first round? No, maybe uh, more of my lungs right now and the adrenaline dump I had, but definitely I wasn't worried at all. I just, I could feel his power decrease every punch. So. Do you think you did enough to get Dana's attention? I don't know. I didn't fight for Dana White tonight. I fought for myself. You know, like everybody keeps coming here and like, I want the contract, I want the contract. You saw the fights today. All of them were amazing. Those guys didn't fight for the contract, they fought for themselves. Contract will come if Dana likes you. Absolutely. Congratulations, Julian.